You want to know why it is that cells shows why it is that cells in a given region of an embryo show particular patterns of cell behavior, particular shapes. And now I tell you, well, that's because they're expressing different gene products. That doesn't really answer the question because what you really want to know is how is it that spatial and, and temporal patterns of gene uh, expression are established at the blastoderm stage. And we'll go back again to this central idea that it's at this stage, the onset. Uh, right before gastrulation, right before these cell shape changes begin to occur, that individual uh, uh, genes come to be expressed in the embryo in specific patterns. But I indicated that before that stage, cell behaviors were uniform, and maternal RNAs and proteins, uh, and they depend on maternal RNAs. And most of those maternal RNAs and proteins, and actually for a long time we thought all of them, were uniformly distributed throughout the egg. But what we've learned now is that we have to put the emphasis on mostly. Uh, these are maternal RNAs and proteins that are supplied and necessary during these early stages are mostly uniform, but there's a very small number of proteins and RNAs that are put into the egg by the mother and show distinct patterns of distribution. And one of the most important of these, and this will be important for the remainder of my talk, is a protein called bicoid. It's a transcription factor supplied by the mother. It's present during these early stages. And if you look at its distribution in the embryo, early embryo, you can see that this protein is localized at high concentrations at the anterior end of the egg, the future head region of the egg, and then grades off in a posterior, uh, grades off uh, in, in cells as we move more and more posterior in the embryo. And one of the things we've learned and that I'll tell you more about is the controlling role for this protein distribution in establishing the patterns of gene expression and transcription that occur at these stages, at this process right before gastrulation, and that are responsible for the cell shape changes.